Until recently, WhatsApp only allowed users to log in on a single device at a time. However, the application has now introduced a new feature by which you can use WhatsApp on multiple devices at the same time. So in today's video, we're going to talk about the same. So now without wasting any more time, let's get started. So on the new device, wherever you want to use your WhatsApp, you have to first make sure that the application is up to date. So after this, open WhatsApp application, select language as well as the TNCs and permissions. Now on the screen where it asks for your WhatsApp number, you have to click on the three dots and select link existing account. Might happen with you that you won't see such option. So all you will need to do is to uninstall the WhatsApp application and download the latest version of WhatsApp again on your phone. You can also refer to the link which is given below in the video's description as well as in the pinned comment for downloading the latest version of WhatsApp. So once you will see the option, just click on that and then go to the device on which you are already using WhatsApp. Then go to link device option and then add the device by scanning the QR code being shown on the new device. Just after this, it will start loading your charts. It will take few minutes for the complete sync up. But after this, you can use WhatsApp on any of the device, even if the data is turned off on your primary device. This feature is pretty cool and useful for people who use multiple devices. So in case if you don't get the option of link existing account, then refer to the application link, which is given below in the video's description as well as in the pinned comment. And by that link, you can download the latest version of WhatsApp application and it's gonna work there for sure. So if you guys like the video, then drop a like, subscribe to the channel. With that being said, I'm Devyan Sharon and I will catch you in the next one.